This is I Love My Wife shirt. Oh, wait. It's I Love It When My Wife Lets Me Buy More Guns shirt. But I do love my wife. She got this for me. I wanted to show you what we'll be shooting today. The Benjamin Bulldog 357 by Crossman. And um, as you can see, it's about 36 inches long. Uh, it's got Picatinny rails along the entire top. And also has Picatinny rails on the bottom so you can put a bipod down there. Um, it's got a safety. Obviously a safety in this is the safety right here. Um, the trigger's pretty nice. I think it's about three pounds. Um, of course, uh, I put a gun skin on this, and then there's the uh, there's the the measurement gauge for the pounds per square inch of in the air in the tank. Um, anyway, it's not the it's not the most beautiful gun, so that's why I put a gun skin on it. Um, and then I, this is not the scope that I'll be using, but I put on a vector, I'll put on a vector optics uh, marksman uh, scope that's a first focal plane that was 6 by 24 by 50. And um, I will also show you um, with this scope, this is a $47 CV Life scope on off of Amazon, and I shot... Um, some pretty good groups with this scope at 50 yards. Um, again, at 50 yards, it averages anywhere from like one and a half to two inch groups. And at 100, it, it averages anywhere from <clears throat> four inches to seven inches, depending on. And, and of course, that's with the, that's with the Amazon scope. So um, with a better scope, I, you know, I've seen my Terminator get about um on an average four inch groups but on up to like six inches with some flyers in there um you know this is not this is just a really fun gun um so anyway that's that's all i have for you right now and then we'll take the crony numbers and um we'll see what we can do with that information okay um, so I'm going to show you how to load the Benjamin Bulldog. First of all, though, I wanted to show you, these are 22 pellets. That's pretty small. The next size up is the 84, I'm sorry, the 81 JSB Diablo pellets. Uh, the one, we may be shooting those, but this is definitely the one I'm going to shoot. This is a 97 grain Diablo lead pellet. Uh, the next one up is 126 grain slug. And then the last one I was going to show you is the, um, is the Benjamin Nosler extreme rifle bullets. These are 145 grain. These are 126 grain. These are 97 grain. These are 81 grain. And this is 14 grain. So you can see that the people who hunt, I don't hunt, but the people who hunt use these. And um, this is what kills a, a small deer or a hog or a coyote um, or bigger game they've seen done, done in South Africa. But what I like to use is these 97 grain uh, Diablo shaped pellets because they're very accurate. And um, we're going to see what speeds we get out of the chronograph with these 97s. And then I might do some of the 81s. Um, who knows? I might do one or two. Uh, well, I might not do one of those. Those are pretty dangerous. And I'm shooting in my bedroom. So at a pellet trap. which is So this is how you load it. Um, it's It's got a red indicator saying it's empty. Put your finger below there. Drop it in. One, two, three, four, and five. And then the green indicator means it's full. The magazine is full. This is for the Benjamin Bulldog. And I'm going to show you how to basically I load this like this. 
it's uncocked. You can see, actually, first the, the gauge right there is at 3,000 PSI. Okay, so we cock the bolt, the, the lever back there. Click it in and lock the, uh, the lever like that. Okay, so let me show you how to shoot it. Okay, so we're going to get some chrony, some chronograph numbers here. Uh, I'm just going to shoot five and see what happens here. It's a Benjamin Bulldog 357 with 97 grain Diablo shaped pellets. Oh, that one didn't register. Let's try this again. 835. Okay, ready? Go ahead and show that. Okay, ready? And one last shot. It guess that didn't register either, but let's see. That didn't register, but okay, so. measured the sp speed, the feet per second of the 97 grain Diablo shaped pellets coming out, and only two out of the five shots registered. One was 856, and the other one was, I think, 835 feet per second. Um, what I find is this Benjamin Bulldog is a little more powerful than the. Um, not even just a little more powerful, but a lot more powerful than the Terminator. Um, but then again, you know, with these different shaped pellets, um, again, this, these, these are the ones that you will get about 200 foot-pounds of energy in, in your first, you know, one or two, three shots. Um, the Benjamin Bulldog shoots about... Um, 10 shots and then you have to refill it and it just shoots through two magazines um again and i've seen the feet per second on this i think it's i think it's more like about 760 shooting these um because they're so heavy they're 145 grains um but again i just wanted you to see the difference between there um anyway got some pretty interesting numbers out of this and this is one of my favorite rifles because it shoots I think it shoots a little more accurately than the Terminator um, that I own too but uh, that's it see you guys in the next video please like and subscribe if you like this content and uh, we'll see you have a <laughs> have a happy new year and we'll see you on in the next video bye